What is going on everybody? It is the Box1654 here and today I'm going to be bringing you a brand new video. Today I'm going to show you how to unlock all of the uh, operator skins for woods and what's available at the moment right now and how to not only achieve this through the operator mission. So uh, let's get into not only the steps of what you have to do in order to unlock these skins, uh, what you have to have equipped, the challenges for it as well too, and what level in the tier, in the season one tier uh, system or the fuck am I trying to say? The season one, uh, season one, uh, battle pass, uh, you have to be a certain tier in order to unlock, uh, these free skins so that you don't have to, you know, you can, you still have to, will have to grind for them, but they're not something that you're going to have to buy in a bundle, uh, which is nice there. Before we do get into showing you all of that information there for you, uh, make sure you guys do hit that like button, that subscribe button, and that bell notification so you do know when we go live when we do upload uh, for further content uh, just to help you to improve not only at Call of Duty uh, Cold War, but just to keep you updated on all brand new info that comes out for uh, this game. So without further ado, let's get into that and I'll be able to break everything down for you. Okay, so first thing first, uh, I put out a video earlier today. You, In order to unlock these operator skins, you have to be that particular operator. You can't be anybody else. You have to be that particular operator. Also, the very key thing here, as you can see, is uh when you in terms of getting this bundle you have to be a certain level in the tier system in order to unlock it i'll show you for example um as you can see here for adler it says right there the second battle pass you can see uh for adler it says battle pass tier 90 it's locked for me that means that i can't physically be able to try to do those uh challenges and operator missions until i'm that level tier so that's a very key thing before you guys start asking me, you know, I'm doing this and I can't get it, I can't get it. Make sure that in, in order to get for Woods here, you have to be tier 70. And I'll show you that right now for uh, for you guys here. In order to get this, this, these are the missions here. You have to be tier 70 in the Battle Pass, the Season 1 Battle Pass. That's just what you have to do in order to get these skins. But I want to showcase this to you and show you an easy way how to just complete these four so you can get these two free skins. Here is actually me unlocking the final step there. We just need to get a Bloodthirsty in order to unlock them. And boom, I get it. Honestly, Hardcore was the easiest way to get them. So that's the Unkillable Objective 4. I got the last objective for uh, unlocking the woods and unlocking that operator mission there. So let's go over and showcase you all of the skins very quickly there for you. Okay, as you can see here, we have unlocked all of the available free skins there for woods. Uh, this one here is basically you have to purchase the operator pact. Uh, that's if you want to. Um, that's this bundle here, which is 1500 COD points. I'm just showcasing you and showing you how to basically unlock the free wood skins that they give you in uh, the tier system. Now, like I said in the beginning of the video, you do have to be tier uh, 70 in order to achieve these. That's a big thing, but you end up getting these three here. As you can see there, I unlocked the very last one that you need, which is the five uh, kills, which is just one bloodthirsty. I can actually go through them here and uh, go back into the battle pass just to show you guys exactly what you would need in order to unlock it, which is going to be tier 70 here if we go and view the missions first one is one-on-one -on -one in, in uh, war zone as a prisoner that means that you need to go into war zone play a solo match you have to physically uh, go in there win in the gulag and then basically either die during uh, the war zone match and, or win it one of the two you if i think i'm pretty sure if you're leaving the match right now i believe they do not count it's very similar to multiplayer i think the progression does not count so make sure you guys are doing that and completing the match, whether you die or whether you end up getting, uh, you know, um, oh, the you know the win on that one. Then get 15 multi or eliminations using the paranoia or high alert perks. So that's where you can use them both, either in Modern Warfare Warzone or you can also use it in Call of Duty. I just did this one in one match. I did the paranoia perk, and I was uh, good to go. This one here is get five survivor medals. So basically, like you're almost dead, and you're like on your you're like got like 10% health left, and that's how you're going to be able to unlock uh, that one. Very easy in hardcore matches. Very easy. You get shot once, uh, and you're kind of, or you get, you know, shot or explosion goes, and you have flak jacket on, and you're like barely alive. Try to just get as many kills as you can on that. You can get it in one game. It's very easy. And then this one here is just one bloodthirsty. So it's very simple, very straightforward. You end up getting uh, these two skins here and the unkillable pack there. 
uh, this particular skin here from the uh, these two are the from the unkillable and this one was just from tier 70 so this one is what you on um, these two you can unlock once you reach level 70 and this one um, to do the missions and this one is what you physically get just for being tier 70 so these are the three new ones you guys can get in the battle pass there you can get them in warzone you can also get them in cold war and these are the objectives that you have to do in, to in order to complete the operator mission as you can see that i did on the right hand side there so thank you guys so much for watching uh, if you guys have any questions let me know down below make sure you hit that like button and that subscribe button and i'll see you on the next one take care